Yo ho. What up, everybody? How's it going? Wayne already says, and here we are. Got a crazy tuning, crazy low tuning here. Let's see how this goes. Oh, that sounds nicer. Got some hot mics in here. Yo, yo, what up, everybody? Wayne says, <laughs> why everyone's coming on the sweater? What about the freaking guitar playing, you jerks? Um, my mother-in-law got me this sweater a couple Christmases ago. And uh, I wore it a ton last year, and then I kind of forgot I had it this year. And just busted it out for the late, late winter. More comments on the sweater than the guitar playing, though. Disappointing. I've worked years and years on this guitar playing, guys. This sweater, I don't know, you know, some poor bastard in... Vietnam. Uh, hey, I heard a really kick-butt version of Seven Nation Army Travis picked on my local radio station. If you like the song, you may want to see if you can find it. Uh, dude, I've had to teach that song to way too many kids. Uh, but that sounds kind of interesting. Thanks. Thanks, Drunk Vigo. Hey, good morning, Akio. How's it going? Nice sweater. Thank you. Where are you, where are you tuning in from? You didn't tell us last time. You ran away before you, you chatted with us. What up, Dame Ann Allen? Thanks, thanks. Is it a sweater or a sweatshirt? What's the difference? I still don't know. So guys, I, I was just like, uh, wanted to like get out of the normal zone. So I just started like turning my guitar to different tunings. And I got a B, it's super low. B, an E, your genius guitar playing, it goes above our heads, bro. <laughs> but we understand the sweater. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> we got a B, an E, another B. So usually if it was open D, right? If it was open tuning, isn't it a fifth? But here I've got a fourth. So that's already, no, isn't it normally a fourth? No, isn't it D, A? So it's a fifth. Here we got a fourth. Another B, another E. So it's just Bs and Es. And then I give you the, play the G sharp up here. So it's like an open E and then another B. So it's like open E tuning, but but not normal open E. And it's fun, just coming up with cool stuff. What was the other little one I had? Let me see if I can remember it here.
make of guitar is that beauty. Dude, this thing is a true piece of junk, and it's my favorite piece of junk. Hey, Luke J, did you just send me an email that I didn't reply to? I'm overdue. It's been like three days since I've responded to an email. If that was Luke, you, Luke, I did read it, and thank you if you recently found the channel and uh, were thanking me for the hard work. Uh, so I don't know. My friend in um, high school painted this thing for me, and she got it at like a... I think it was an antique sale and it just hung on my wall for like 10 years and I didn't think it was playable because it was painted without strings on it and uh, one day I was desperate because I don't know I left my guitar somewhere and I had a pair of strings I'm like I'm gonna see if this freaking thing works and ever since I did that um, it's been my go-to guitar to kind of teach on because I don't care if it gets banged up so she painted this that's my old punk rock band down at the bottom and then my old neighbor, who was like this 10-year-old, uh, you know, kid, painted this. He had superpowers. He was on the spectrum. But he was like unbelievably talented at graffiti art. I don't even know that he was 10 years old when he painted this. Kind of bright. Isn't that dope? Reminds me of Leo. <clears throat> so I don't even know what make it is because there's this, a little, like a little love note inside. And I'm, I don't have the heart to take it off. It says something about there's a... The world needs a star, a special star, a rock star. So hurry up and rock out. And I can't take the note out to find out who, what the make is. That would just, just take the magic away from the guitar. He was on the spectrum for superpowers, exactly. Come on, we probably have some autists in the YouTube chat, don't we? Should we songwrite today, guys? What are we going to do? Uh, what do you guys think of this this month? I might take a deep dive into like open tunings and start making some videos on that. Not that I have any time. There's already a million other videos that I started and need to finish. <clears throat> but there's not many resources for like different chord shapes and open tunings. It's surprising. Unless there's resources out there that I've just missed, you know? Now, I guess the show's begun. Nate's here. That's a funny thing when you when you do a random tuning, it's like all guesswork. You know, I haven't thought through like the chord shapes. Thanks, Nate. Yeah, I got I'm just like tuned super low. I got like B E B B G sharp B or something. I just needed to like unscramble. It's good to scramble your brain sometimes and just to get out of the normal chord shapes. Or like now it's like exploring frets in the guitar instead of even thinking about theory, just to see what you can kind of stumble upon.
Brian who's inspired me. I teach this guy Brian and he's been really into open tuning. Should we write a song? <coughs> oi, oi, Savaloy. Savaloy. What up, Bob? Bob the Bacha. <laughs> How's everyone doing today? Just thought you should know that sa sav Savloy is a sausage in the UK, but uses a term to say hi. No, is that for real? Savloy? Savloy? How do you say that? I'm not good at pronouncing stuff. Savloy. Savloy? I don't know, I like it instrumental. Do we want to sing to this one? Savaloy. Oi, oi, Savaloy. feathers but it fails with might as a guillotine yeah thank you thank you I needed the spacing these songs is you have so many chord extensions with the open tuning that it's like hard to even hone in on a pitch to sing <clears throat> uh, we don't have one Bob Debache we just kind of started I got nothing yet I'm just kind of singing Good flows 
my sight Syllables utter as feathers But it falls with my As a guillotine if I do want to play a major chord in this tuning. <laughs> I guess I do. What am I in? I don't know. I just kind of t tuned, turned my knobs. <laughs> so I'm... I got the capo on, but I'm like uh, B, E, B, E, G sharp, B or something. Um, open do, I was just saying that, Bob DeBaccia, like uh, this month I might spend some time like making a few videos talking about open tuning and how to go about it. It's not, and what I was saying earlier too, Bob, it's like, it's nice sometimes to just like, you know, I know it's an E, a e major chord but like I can't theory myself through it, so it's nice to just like explore and find good sounds as opposed to always thinking like, oh, I'm gonna play a one, four, five or a two, whatever, whatever. But maybe it's not the best idea for a song, right? It's really pretty instrumental, but I'm loving this song. Drunk loves it. All right, let's keep trying that. I cream to my knees, my gut floods my side, syllables used as feathers, but it falls with my as a guillotine.
bosom the down of the sun My afternoon never after lives As I kneel wholly undone The pace of seconds As many I just want an F major, but I don't know how to play it in this tuning. <laughs> my tuner to find out what notes I'm playing. That's a cool chorus. All right, Nate, I don't know how to fit, fit all this stuff. Um, but it's kind of cool. And how do I get that smooth? Uh, my freaking thumb. a song in mind. Oh, that's cool. I like it. I cream to my knees My guts flood my sight Syllables uttered as feathers Falls with mine as a git as a as a guillotine as a guillotine. right before the upbeat chorus. A heavy morning mist poisons the down of the sun. My afternoon half As I kneel wholly undone. This is the only weird part. Peace of seconds pass as many.
Just do as a guillotine again. Yeah. All right. Dude, if you guys can copy and paste, can you copy and paste the whole thing for me, Nate? I'm not allowed to copy because if I click on the text, it just boop, it just puts you up on the screen. I don't like that last line song. What the guillotine? Or I know the pace of seconds is minutes doesn't fit. I totally agree with you. Who's got the chorus? It's weird to... I, I know it sounds better when I can hear myself and gauge the mics, but it's also really annoying to hear yourself. <clears throat> I'm sipping tonight. I never drink beer. One Peroni. Okay, don't judge me. Peroni's a good beer, though, I will say. I'm not into the IPA nonsense. Hey there, Jaya Jeff. Jaya, I got a question for you. Um, as you know, I had that hernia operation. It's almost been a year. And, dude, I did something to my guts. Like, it's I don't have a hernia, but, like, right above that site, um, I don't know, I feel like I tore my muscle or something. Like, it feels like it's more torn apart. And I don't know, who do I go talk to? Like, who do I just look up? Like, uh, SD would recommend a rolfer. What up, Rhino? Um, but do I see, like, a masseuse who, like, deals with postpartum women or something? I feel like I have like the beginnings of diastasis recti or something. I have no idea. No, it's a it's a Peroni. I want to pretend I'm in Italy again. Like old times, Rhino. Me and Rhino met on the steps of the Pantheon in Rome. Come see me. <laughs> uh, maybe maybe my buddy Ryan will. You live too far away, man. I'd love to fly out. But I can't leave my family and it's too expensive to fly everyone to Hawaii. And, you know, it doesn't, the Peroni's good. It doesn't make me feel too sick. Me and SD determined that uh, as much as you want to just sip on a simple, um, what the hell are they called again? The Irish one? With the nitrogen in the bottom? Come on, chat, you're too delayed. What's that? What are those called? I can't believe I'm drawing a blank on this. What, what's the beer called? Irish one. Guinness, thank you. How can I forget Guinness? Um, they make you sick, dude. They have like one Guinness and I feel disgusting. A therapist can help you resolve it 100. What do you mean? What kind of therapist? Are you telling me that I've got a psychosomatic illness? <clears throat> you just mean a massage therapist, I know. But any, any one in particular? It's not so easy to find a good one, man. All right, Nate, what's the chorus? Then repaste your lyrics for me. 
All right, for all you newbies, I'm, I'm, I'm in a goofy tuning. A sex, exactly, a sex therapist. <laughs> all right, but look, at, look at what I could do for you, Rhino. I could post it right up there for you. All right, the chorus is, uh, I don't know what it was. Let me play the whole thing again. Oh, you're really going to make me scroll through this? I don't want to type it all out. Can't someone just pa paste it for me? I careen to my knees My guts flow my sight Syllables are his feathers but it falls with might as a guillotine as a guillotine next set of lyrics Heavy morning mist poisons the down of the sun. My afternoon ever after lives as I kneel wholly undone as a guillotine. Something like that. <clears throat> oh, thank you for reposting it. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, a pediatrician. A pediatrician can refer you to a sex therapist. And then I guarantee that your abdominal issues will be resolved. Jaya Jeff has told me how to heal myself. I think his advice is pretty worthless. Those are all the lyrics that I have. Oh man, is it really? This is a depressing song. Gosh darn you. Desist? Desist. Desist? A therapist? A desist? I don't know what you're referring to, Nate. Pediatrician can refer you to the specialist you need And then you'll be okay and you'll have everything Have you guys ever heard of uh, Jandek? He's this guy who like detunes his guitar It's really funny Jandek I was at a record store, Amoeba Records in San Francisco. And the album cover was just like, whoa, I'm going to buy this. And it was just like a random purchase based on the album cover. Let me present my screen. Ugh, this is so annoying. I'll just do the entire screen because I don't know how to do it otherwise. There we go. Let me make it big. You guys ready for Jandek? Whoa. Look at this album cover. This is the one that I got. Ready for the House. This 1978 masterpiece. And he's got like 
I don't know, probably a hundred albums, and they just have like covers like this. Look at this. What is happening here? Get out of my face. Remind me tomorrow. I literally do that every day. How do I shut that off, guys? I get the auto update and I just tell it to remind me tomorrow and then I never update it. This one's called Naked in the Afternoon. Me and my buddy James uh, uh, started this thing called Rainbow Musics and we would just... Uh, like do this essentially to take a page out of Jandex book to refresh your musical mind. All right, I've heard enough. I'm disturbed. That's Jandex for you, everybody. How do I stop the share? There we go. Frightening. Jandek frightens me. I used to find it interesting. Now I'm just frightened by it. Um, <clears throat> come on. Who, who, where are our lyricists today? Who are the lyricists in the house? Stoop. It's got to be hula hoop. No, come on. You can't do that. I'm not encouraging drinking, guys. One beer. One beer. Rare occasion, okay? Um, your word washes me clean. It does indeed. It does indeed. Good to see you, Ronnie, by the way. How are you, man? I mean, I kind of like that, Ronnie, actually. Your word washes me clean 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 But we, we need a little bit more in there. 
it can be sparse, but. Something about promising. A great your word, a great promising. Your word. Your word, a great promising. Your word holds. Your word washes me clean, your word, the one promise we need. It's really a remarkable thing. That too, everlasting, remarkable thing. Your word washes me clean, your word, the one promise we need. Too much of the same rhyme, but something like that. <clears throat> We're on to it. Thanks, T. Your word, a remarkable thing. Your word washes me clean. Your word, one, the one promise we need. There's some kind of like more clever scheme in there as a way to phrase it. But your word, a remarkable thing. Your word washes me clean. Under your wing, you know, that's a popular psalm uh, metaphor, being under his wing, right? But your word, a remarkable thing, your word washes me clean. You heard my doubt was the third line shouldn't be word again, but it like We need one line that doesn't start with uh, you heard the doubt. I mean, can we keep doing all rhymes with thing or is that get too overdone? Doubt in 
Lots of options there. I'm just having trouble tying it together. But your word, a remarkable thing. Your word washes me clean. You heard my doubt was creeping. I, I mean, it's a good line, but it, you heard my doubt was creeping. Creeping. I just can't get the syllable to sound right. You heard. It just sounds too forced. You heard. Bing, wing, sing. I don't know. Close, Nate, but no cigar. Yeah, yeah, it's got to be a different rhyme. There we go. Your word, the blessings it brings. Um, you heard my doubt is leaving... Um, I, no, I like it more like I have the doubt and he's curing it. You know, you heard the doubt. Like you heard my doubt coming would be more appropriate. But something about his word uh, rectifying that doubt. Right? Removing the doubt. Your word a remarkable thing Your word it washes me clean We're stuck on this thing. Like, have you listened to Wilco? What do you think of them? Yeah, they're my favorite shit rock band. <laughs> my brother would always make fun of me and call Wilco shit rock. And I've adapted the phrase because it's a very, very appropriate. You know, they try to do the rock and roll thing sometimes, but it's it's not really rock and roll. Uh, no, I like them. I've seen them live a couple times. Um, I can't say I'm like, know their catalog 
deeply, but yeah, the guy can really write some good songs. When he hits, he hits. For sure. I feel like they've got a lot of kind of like meh stuff, but um, it's he's a great songwriter, for sure. Tweety. Lame Tweety. That's an inside joke between me and my wife. We were at Lollapalooza in Chicago, and there was this guy just loaded next to us, and Tweety's up there talking, and it's packed, and um, you know, it's Lollapalooza, and he says something like, this song's a whip, what we call in the business a whip. It's a work in progress. And this drunk guy next to him just goes, lame Tweety. <laughs> and like everybody heard him. Uh, it was really funny. Yeah, but I, yeah, his, his lyrics are great. I shouldn't say that. It's not like I, I dive deep in, but uh, the, he, yeah, he has some cool lyrics for sure. Um, your world a remarkable thing. Your world it washes me clean. You heard the doubt on my tongue. The doubt in, in I don't know. Don't know. What's up, T? Where are you from, man? How's it going? Good to see you in here. You've been learning from the channel and uh, how long you've been playing. Tell us a little bit about yourself, T. Puts me under your wing. Your word, a remarkable thing. Your word, it washes me clean. You heard my doubt approaching. Your word puts me under your wing. I'm happy with my progress. That's awesome, man. Great. Uh, in college, what? In college ATM as well? What's ATM? ATN? Austin, Texas? Texas A&M? ATM? Austin, Texas? Music? In college as well? Cool. What do you, yeah, that's great, man. Glad, yeah, good progress in a year. That's awesome. Yeah, you can get, dude, with, with focused, you know, scheduled, regular, like, deliberate practice, you can make some pretty solid gains, so I'm excited to hear that. Cool. D guys, I don't know if I have a second verse in me. I'm, I might be done. Low showing today. Come on, only five people in the chat? What the heck? What the heck? You heard doubt in my tone. Just wish you'd pick up the phone. You looked out in my tone Just wish you'd pick up the phone Three MMT with full of wind ba -ba -da -ba, ba -da -ba. Cool. This is a good one. The, the lyrics are still all over the place. I didn't copy and paste today. I'm being lazy. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Anyone got a joke? Anyone got a good joke? Well, I copy these lyrics. I careened to my knees. Mm. 
my gut. Floods my sight. Ugh, that's an intense line, mate. Ugh, I know that feeling. Syllables uttered as feathers, but it falls with light. Yep, and hearing the bad news, man. Ugh, that's a great line too, man. As a guillotine. Fuck, now that I'm paying attention to the lyrics, they're really intense. A heavy morning mist. I was saying down, wasn't I? <laughs> Poisons, now that I'm actually like focusing. Poisons the dawn of the sun. Oh man, this is biting, dude. <clears throat> My afternoon ever after this. As I kneel. Holy undone. Youch. Youch. 3 mm. 3 mm is the best you see. He's even greater than me. Yeah, I'm still doing Thursday Zooms. Yeah, I'd love to meet you, T. Come on the Thursday Zooms. We do it every Thursday, 8 Eastern. Um, oh, I'm in college at the moment as well. Look at me. I'm not hip with the shorthand ATM. Um, yeah, we're doing Thursdays. I'm, my afternoon ever after this as I kneel wholly undone. And then what was our chorus? Your word, a remarkable thing. Your word, it washes me clean. You heard my doubt approaching your word puts me under your wing uh, the the chorus is a little too generic uplifting i mean it can be uplifting um it's a little too like christian pop rock though yeah stop by we'll be there you know what i mean but it's fine it's fine for this song right but I will admit it's a little too Christian pop rock. Now right, let's play the whole thing together and then we'll call it a night unless you guys want to discuss or talk something else. I can't really hear myself anymore. There we go. Yeah, and the, the Zoom links um, underneath the videos, just go to the more recent, I think all the videos I put that Zoom link in there. Thank you. 
Sorry to hear that, Nate. Anything in particular, or just sometimes you just are in a dark mood even though nothing's happened? Oh, <laughs> that's a bummer. <laughs> oh. Through a glass darkly With a hole in the tree Have you ever the sea storm? It's the next verse, but not really. I need to rhyme it. Through a glass darkly, with a hole in the truth, like you weather the sea storm. Beautiful song, though, mate. Good lyrics, man. I'll play one more, uh, one more thing before we go. That one I was doing earlier. I kind of want to figure out.
made it. Finally caught a live stream. What's up, dude? Good to see you, man. I always appreciate your comments on my videos. How are you? Good, good, good to see you. We just kind of finished a song, right? You're, you're here late. I'm about to call it a night. Um, I'll file it away later. Yeah, when you find yourself in a similar mood. Good idea. I know. Where is the stinky cheese, man? Um, I really like this one, but I don't know how to sing to it. What instrument should play on this this uh, instrumental track? Like a clarinet or a flute or a, a violin? Cool sweater. Everyone, God damn you, Neil. Everyone's commenting on my sweater and not my freaking guitar playing tonight. <laughs> What's your favorite kind of cheese? Um, sometimes Parmesan when I'm in the mood, but typically I, I like a... Uh, Swiss. Well, no. What's my favorite kind of cheese? And Chango can be really good. Swiss. A Gruyere. A good, just a good cheddar. I like hard cheeses though. I mean, a soft goat cheese can be okay, but soft cheese in general. It's wild. Same number between one and ten. Three. <laughs> you got any lyric ideas, Neil? Are you still here? Neil, you want to write the second verse for us? Let us know if you're ready, Mr. Dobbs. <clears throat> Dang, I know that would have been sweet if we said the same number. But you could have just lied and waited for me to say it, and that would have been funny. I'm not gonna forget this song. Uh, no, I, I switched it up. What did, where did I have the capo, guys? Third fret. Oh, this was it. Huh?
Pretty cool. I don't think we need a bridge. We just need a second verse, though. Hey, thanks, Neil. You're welcome, man. I mean, you're welcome. What am I saying? I'm reading Nate's. Yeah, you're welcome, dude. And thank you, Neil. Yeah, it's a pretty one. <laughs> gonna go to bed guys I think maybe go on a walk I've been sitting too long today oh better walk it's kind of late <laughs> so that's my advice today just tune your guitar all funny and, um, see what happens guys thanks for the help nate great song great lyrics um neil jump on earlier next time man where are you you stateside where are you all right next time next time peace peace i finally got you flying to the moon down you did hey that was yes you commented on that one too um is it smooth dude i love it when people um record yourself playing it and shoot me an email man i would be happy to listen it makes me just ridiculously happy when people are uh, learning from the channel. And then I'll also give you some feedback, you know, if you're, you want some critique, maybe there's a couple things I can pick up on that you could uh, improve your playing with. So record yourself doing it, Neil. would love to listen. Yeah, please do. Please do. All right. Peace, guys. Good night. Good night. Later. Peace. Peace.